for this video, we have a new product to unbox and review, which is sponsored by Galaxy Alpha. How did Galaxy Alpha happen? So I received an email that they'll be sending me a product that I'll be showing to you guys in this video, which is a Galaxy projector. So it's actually my first time to see a Galaxy projector. I thought it's the usual projector that we use to watch movies, but this one is different. It will transform the entire atmosphere of your room and give you a magnificent galaxy. I'm sure you're excited to see the product now, and so let's watch this unboxing video. So, hi guys! As you can see, ito may malahit ayong package dito. And it came from Galaxy Alpha. And ay so pindala siya through DHL and it came today May 10. Ayan. Ay so simulan natin ang pag-unbox. So nung dumating siya kanina, syempre dapat ang una nating gawin, disinfect. So since I'm at work, I asked my sister to Disinfect it. Tapos, tinabi lang muna siya sa sandali sa gilid. Actually, this package came from Hong Kong. Ipat natin siya ng maigi para hindi sayang yung plastic. So, we can reuse it at gawing basurahan. Ito na siya. I'm actually excited to see this. So, ang tagal ko din inintay ito. So, mga parang almost two weeks. Ayun yung pumagpakita. Ito na siya. Siyang nakabubble wrap. So, yan. As you can see, sobrang um, secured ng item, no? So, nakabubble wrap siya. And may nakapalibot na scotch tape. Ito na siya. So yun laki niya actually. Hindi naman siya super laki. I expected a little bit big. Pero ayan. Enough lang yung size niya. Yung box medyo wrinkled siya. Slightly wrinkled. Siguro kasi sa pag yung deliver na din. Sa tagal ng biniyahe niya. So yun. But I hope what's inside is protected. And let's see. So, yeah. First thing that you see. Yeah. Manual. It's manual over here. And then dito. I know it's too far. I'm going to separate shoot. So, I'll just unbox it and test it for a few days before we make a review. So, yun, sa ibabaw niya, yun, dito, tinanggal ko siya. Ito yung unang meron, which is yung parang min micro USB charger. <laughs> yan. So, yun, the usual. Ang dami ko ng ganito. Kasi kada gadget na bibilihin, meron kasama ganito. Which is also good kasi, di ba? Ipaprovide sila ng wires. And ito may dalawang paa for the UFO. So, dalaw Ay, ayun. Ito pa may another fit. Ayan. Apat na piraso. So, ayan. Ba't ko ba sila inaalis? So, dito nga muna kayo. Okay. And then, here's the UFO. Ayan na siya. So, wala nang laman ng box. So, here it is. So, yung may kita nyo naman, uh, kahit na medyo narinkled yung box, sa loob naman, meron siyang kasamang styro. Yan. Protected. Ito, makapal na styro siya. Tapos, Ito yung naka-cover dun sa mismong UFO. Ito na siya. Naka-plastic pa. 
So, yun. Mukha talaga siyang UFO. Diba? Mm, yung size niya, um, hindi ko pa sure kung gano siya kalaki. And then, after this uh, part of the video, after ko siya maitry ng ilang araw, yun, I'll make a review. So, yun. Ngayon, um, ayan, in-unbox ko lang muna siya. Okay? So, I'm excited to test this. Kaya today, binuksan ko din kaagad siya. Kahit yan, late na. Kasi gusto ko siya matry ngayong gabi. Before I go to sleep. So, if you want to know how to use this UFO Galaxy projector, stay on the video. And I will give a review and tutorial on how to use this one. Okay? When Galaxy Alpha launched, they only have two projectors, which is the Galaxy Projector Lite and the Galaxy One Projector, which is this one. The projector that I'll be reviewing in this video and giving you a demo on how to use it. And recently, they've released another product, which is a mini projector. It's the usual projector that we use to watch movies and create our own home theater. The Galaxy One Projector is a modern gadget that engulfs any room in a galactic experience of stars, light, and color. It has a user-friendly functions and endless projection effects that you can simply relax and immerse yourself in the galaxy's wonders. There are two features of this product which is the manual mode and the app mode. So the manual mode allows you to press the keys here on the projector to switch it to different functions or to different modes. While the, the app mode, it allows you to uh, control the projector using an app, which is called the Starlight app or the SD Light app. The Galaxy One projector has built-in speakers, sound activation mode, unique meteor function, and a timer switch. Now let's explore what's inside the box. When you open the box, the first thing that you will see is the manual. It is translated into different languages, such as English, German, French, Spanish, Italian, and Japanese. They've also included a micro USB charging cable and the four legs of the UFO Galaxy One projector. And finally, you'll see the projector itself, wrapped in a soft plastic and protected by this kind of styrofoam. The legs should be facing this way, and not this way. Be careful when attaching the legs, because it is made of plastic. But there's no need to worry, it is strong enough to carry the whole projector. The next thing that we'll do is I will show you on how to use this UFO projector. First, let's start operating this manually. The first thing that you should do is to plug the USB charging cable at the UFO projector. And at the other end, you can attach an adapter and plug it directly to an outlet. Or you can either plug it to a power bank. Then, press this to turn on the UFO projector. As you can see, you can also attach a flash drive and play the songs from it. Here are the functions of these buttons that you can use to manually operate the projector. First, let's start on the left side. Click the third button 
to play and pause the music. Now, long press the first button to decrease the volume. And long press the second button to increase its volume. And short press the second button to play the next song. Now, to switch modes, click the fourth button to change from Bluetooth mode to white noise mode. This projector has different ambient sounds. Let's try the voice control switch. Click the fourth button at the lower right side. And you'll see it started blinking together with the beat. To control the ripple lights colors, click the first button at the right side to change it from blue to red to green and to white. Keep pressing to show the breathing effect in mixed colors. Next, to control the laser and the moon, click the second button. And for the meteor switch, click the third button. Now that we're done operating this manually, let me show you now on how to control the UFO projector using the mobile app. To download the app, you can scan the code from the manual and simply install it. Or you can search for the Starlight or SD Light app on Play Store or Apple Store to download and install the app. Before using the app, make sure that your Bluetooth is open and already connected to your projector. Once installed, click the Starlight app and it will start scanning the device. Click the Scan Projector to connect it. And then, you'll see the main interface of this app. So what are the functions of these things? The first line is used to adjust the light's brightness, while the second line is used to adjust the sound volume. And the third line is used to adjust the voice control sensitivity once the voice control function is turned on, while the last line is used to adjust the motor's rotation speed. Now, let's move on to the tabs below. The first tab is the color module. You can select the color that you want and mix it with other colors that will give you a nebula effect. And the next tab is the music module where you can pause and play the music or change it into different ambient sound.
you have here the white noise, the verses 1 and verses 2, or the lullabies, and the wind sound, the bonfire, sea wave, and many more. And for the next tab, the control module. You have here the moon switch, the laser switch, the voice control switch, the laser mode can be always on or breathing, the ripple lights switch, or if you want to use a single color, or mixed colors, and lastly, the meteor switch. And for the last tab, which is the timing module. Now let me show you how to set the timer. Let's set this to one minute and click on and then click OK. Meaning, we set the timer to turn on the projector. Now, let's try to turn off the projector. Let's set another one minute and disable this button, meaning we would like to turn off the projector. And then click OK. And lastly, the button at the middle is the projector's main switch. That's how to use the UFO Galaxy One projector. Very easy, right? So you have two options. Make it work manually or use the mobile app. It's time for me to give a review about the Galaxy One projector. It's really beautiful when you have a closer look with the product, no? And it really gives the Galaxy vibe. Kasi dun pa lang sa design ng product, you already um, can feel, you can already feel yung pagka-Galaxy ng place. Kasi ito, yung mismong projector is a UFO. So yun, parang diadala ka niya dun sa kalawakan. I've tried using this one for a week before I created this review or this video. So every uh, every day after a long day at work, uh, before going to sleep, I try to open this one and play some good music. Tas magrelax lang ayan. So ang ganda ng tignan sa gabi. Talagang uh, kung may kita nyo naman dun sa video kanina, de ba? It's really good and sobrang uh, lawak nung na ano niyang space, yung, kumbaga, yung napaproject ng lights. Actually, ang uh, liwanag ng lights niya, what I mean, kahit na malaki yung room, tingin ko, mapapaliwanag niya. Tsaka yung, um, kumbaga, sa usual projector, yung layo niya, nakadepende dun yung laki or lawak din ng kaya niyang sakupin. Kaya kung mas mataas yung ceiling ng room, tas, syempre, mas mababa siya, ano, sa, let's say, nilagay mo sa floor, yan, mas malaki yung kaya niyang i-cover na space. And also, this projector, it's not hard to operate. So, you have two options. Yun niya, yung, you can um, use it manually or using the app. Kung mas convenient sa yung app. And if in case na wala kang dalang phone or you just want to play a music from here, meron siyang USB port dito na pwede mong lagyan ng flash drive. Tapos, automatic yung madadetect niya yung music. Tapos, you can just click the buttons here to switch or to change the music, no? 
And what I like the most about this projector, it has a timer. So you can set a timer, no? So I don't have to worry even if I fall asleep at night. Kasi yun, kung saan siyang mamamatay pag sinet ko yung timer niya. Nakita nyo naman dun sa video. I'm not sure if clearly, ayan, naintindihan nyo yung uh, pag-set ko ng timer, no? Pero yun, madali lang naman siya i-operate using the app. Yun nga lang, masaset mo yung timer just using the app and hindi siya pwede dito sa may manual mode. So, kailangan nakakonect siya sa phone mo. This projector pala, no, is made of plastic. And there's also yung legs niya. Pero it's strong enough naman to protect the whole uh, UFO projector. Tsaka, ayun, medyo konti, medyo heavy siya. And although it's made of plastic, for sure, um, hindi siya agad-agad nasisira. Yun nga lang, syempre, Huwag niyo ibagsak. <laughs> Iwasan natin na mahulog siya. Yan. Kaya dapat, lagi lang siyang nakalagay sa isang tabi. And lastly, if you have kids, they would definitely love this projector. For sure, they will enjoy as much as I do. And by the way, this projector has advanced screen laser lens that protects your eyes while enjoying the different light effects. So it is safe for you and for your kids. For the price of this product, no, so, syempre, gusto nyo rin malaman kung magkana itong projector. It's actually quite pricey. So, the cost of this projector is $129.99 and currently discounted to $79.99. Siguro, uh, estimation is at around three five to 4000 plus. So, it's quite pricey, kaya hindi ko siya i-recommend sa inyo na bilihin niyo, lalo na if you have tight budget. So, unahin natin kung ano yung mas essential. So, yun, kaya masasabi ko lang naman with this one, yung price niya talaga namang match dun sa product itself. As you can see naman dun sa um, functions na pinakita ko sa inyo kanina, no? So, marami siyang kayang gawin. At saka, and very entertaining kasi itong product na to. So, you will really enjoy this one using this product. For sure, curious din kayo malaman kung magkano naman ang price ng another projector, which is the projector light. So, it's actually also on sale from $99.99 to $59.99. So, di hamak na mas mura siya dito kay Galaxy One Projector. Pero kasi si Galaxy uh, Projector Light, ang alam ko, function niya is mapapagana mo siya using uh, remote control switch. So, mayroon siyang tiny remote. Uh, while this one, si Galaxy One Projector, yan, meron na siyang switch dito, and using the app. And lastly, for the mini projector, so yung usual projector yung na ginagamit natin to watch movies, it's from $169.90, and the discount siya to $99.99. So more like nasa 5,000 pesos siya. So I hope, I actually hope, na mabigyan nila ako ng chance to give another review for that kind of projector. Kasi yun talaga actually yung gusto kong makuha ang projector. Magkaroon ng ganong klase ng projector. Which is a portable mini projector at home lang naman. Hindi yung medyo mamahalin ng mga projector. So enough na sa akin yung ganon. Basta makanood lang tayo ng medyo, sabi natin, malaking screen. And for the special part here, these items are already discounted. But you can get an additional of 10% if you use my code, just Galaxy to avail their products. Check out their website, galaxyalpha.com, to get to know more about them and their products. They also offer free shipping, so you better check their website regularly. And I think they're still posting new products, since they're still new to the public. So that's all for this video and I hope you liked it because I've enjoyed showing you my new stuff here and special thanks to Galaxy Alpha for sending me my first Galaxy projector which is the Galaxy One projector. And thank you for choosing me to review your new product. So see you again on my next vlog.